we now place ourselves in the loving presence of God. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your Lord. spirit. Thank you, Lord, for the gift of this day. Thank you for gathering us together as we entrust to you. Our members who are not here with us, our respective families, wherever they are, we ask, Lord, to keep them safe. Bless us, O Lord, and grant the desires of our hearts. Keep us always faithful to you. May we always hear you, listen to you, for you are the word of the Father. May your spirit be upon each one of us and we continue to live our lives to the full and become witnesses of your kingdom here on earth. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to St. Luke. Glory, Glory, Glory to you, to you Lord. 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 Jesus passed through towns and villages, teaching as he went and making his way to Jerusalem. Someone asked him, Lord, will only a few people be saved? He answered them, strive to enter through the narrow door. For many, I tell you, will attempt to enter, but will not be strong enough. After the master of the house has arisen and locked the door, then will you stand outside, knocking and saying, Lord, open the door for us. He will say to you in reply, I do not know where you are from. And you will say, we ate and drank in your company and you taught in our streets. Then he will say to you, I do not know where you are from. Where you are from. Depart from me, you evil doers. And there will be wailing and grinding of teeth. When you see Abraham, Isaac and Jacob and all the prophets of the kingdom of God and you yourselves cast out. And people will come from the east and the west and from the north and then the south and will recline at table in the kingdom of God. For behold, some are last who will be first and some are first who will be last. The gospel of the Praise the Lord be with you. Good morning and good evening. Good morning, evening, Father. Evening, Father. Today the Lord is asking us, so inviting us, as he answered those people who asked him, Lord, will only a few people be saved? And he answered, and that's an invitation, strive to enter through the narrow gate. Of course, the narrow gate, when uh, he had given this one before to the rich man, where he said it is easier for a camel to pass the narrow door, the needle's eye, than for a rich man to enter the kingdom of heaven. He was referring to the small gate that was for the elephants used in the, te the temple area or around the Jerusalem uh, wall, so much so that it is only intended for them. So that was the needle eye that he was saying. But you see, when we say the narrow door, he wanted to tell us, first and foremost, it's not just about knowing the Lord. It's not about just crying to him, Lord, Lord. He wanted to tell us that when we know him, when we call him Lord, Lord, then we live our lives according to his indication. We obey and we follow. So beyond the mouth profession is the life profession of our life. The narrow door is the narrow door of sacrifice, of endurance, of perseverance, of love, of forgiveness, which is opposite to the wider door of pride, of sinfulness, of impurity, and other things that are happening in the world. So much so that when the Lord invites us to enter the narrow door, it's the door of his sacrifice on the cross, the door of his love for us when he gave his life for us, when he shed his blood for us. So he said, try to enter the narrow door. But you see, the most tragic, perhaps, moment in our life, even we have shared this one before, when the Lord would say, I do not know where you are from. Twice it was said here. But the second time we say, I do not know where you are from. He said, depart from me, all you evildoers. So you see, the drinking with the Lord, the dining with him, the calling him would not be enough for us. We could not, it could not be also enough for us to simply say, Lord, I am a Catholic. Lord, I am a Christian. Lord, we pray the rosary. Lord, we hear the mass. 
if there is no action for that, especially for our brothers and sisters. Remember, he sent them two by two because he wanted to tell that the two by two represents the love of God and the love of neighbor. They go together. There could be no love of God when there is no love of neighbor or vice versa. And so he said a tragic moment of our life when the Lord would reject us. I do not know you depart from me. Then we will see all those people coming from the east, the west, perhaps the sinners, those who are nothing, those who are exploited, those who are nobody, but now they're in the kingdom of heaven because of their humility, because of their love for the Lord, because of their acceptance of who they are. And so therefore reclining with Abraham, Jacob, and Isaac in the kingdom of heaven. So much so that the last part of the gospel is a reflection of where the Jewish people are. Some who are last will be first, and some who are first will be last. The first are those people chosen where the Lord came for the Jewish people, but still they do not accept him. The last are the Gentile people who have heard Paul, and we are part of that, and we have accepted the faith. But the most important is, beyond acceptance of faith, we live it, and we find works in that, so that we will do as well the very mission that the Lord has entrusted to us. May we find that narrow door. May we not only cry, Lord, Lord, but leave what the Lord wanted from us. And ultimately, may we be one of those people that the Lord will say, I know you. Come and inherit the kingdom prepared for you from the foundation of the world. Amen. 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 Thank you, Amen. Lord Jesus. Thank, Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Lord Jesus. For the gift of love and compassion. For the gift of love and compassion. You challenge us to enter the narrow door. You challenge us to enter the narrow door. The narrow door of love and forgiveness. The narrow door of love and forgiveness. Of compassion and understanding. And of compassion and understanding. Of charity and generosity. Of charity and generosity. And to avoid the wider doors of pride. And to, and to avoid the wider doors of pride. Selfishness. Selfishness. Being self-righteous and judgmental. Being self-righteous and judgmental. Of negativity and hopelessness. Of negativity and hopelessness. Lord, we pray and desire. Lord, we pray and desire that every day and at the end of our lives, that every day and at the end of our lives, you will know us. You will know us. You will know us. Recognize us. Recognize us. And welcome us into your home. Where you are with the Father and the Holy Spirit. Where you are with the Father and the Holy Spirit. With the Blessed Mother and Saint Joseph. With the Blessed Mother and Saint Joseph. And all the angels and saints in heaven. And all the angels and saints in heaven. Amen. 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 Hail Mary, full of grace. The Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy, Holy Mary, Mary, Mother, 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 pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Saints Michael, Raphael, and Gabriel, pray for pray us. For pray for us. us. Angel of God. My guardian, my guardian, of God's love, come into me, dear. God, but it's night, and God, 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 and and with, and with your spirit. spirit. May Almighty God bless us, our families, the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Good evening all and good morning. Good evening, good Father. Good evening, Father. Thank you again. Thank you once again. Hi, Tarems. Good evening. Welcome for... Good evening, Father. Good evening, Father.
So, um, may wrong notion ang ibang faith to father, no? Na I heard this mm -hmm. from, from a very, very close family member, no? Na, na for for each and every, ano, for each and every sin daw, we are already forgiven kasi nga, God is all merciful. So, uh, hindi siya naniwala na for every sin, there's always a consequence. Hindi siya naniwala. And then, hindi siya naniwala na may purgatory. Kasi daw, God is that merciful. So, okay lang. For for him, okay lang. Kasi, okay lang mag-commit siya ng sin. Kasi God is so merciful. So, itong, itong, ang team ng gospel natin, ba na presumption? Ginapresume mm -hmm. niya na, Anyway, God is so merciful. Sige, magpakasala. Mag, uh, we will commit sin. Uh, ganyan ba? B very wrong notion. Very na I really don't know how to convince him back to Catholic faith. Now, mm -hmm. to convince him now for every sin, my consequence talaga yan. Yeah. I mean, so, the, Lord, the Lord is compassionate. The Lord is merciful. In fact, He died for us. But we have to humble ourselves in order to ask for forgiveness and not to do the same again. Diba? He would always say, go and do not sin no more, and sin no more. So after he has forgiven, there is a challenge of not repeating the sin, of not going back to the old ways of our life. So that's the mercy of God. Kaya nga, as long as we live, it's the mercy of God. When we die, that's already the justice of God. So how we live our life every day, he invites us to go back to him. And when we humble ourselves, acknowledge our sins, then the forgiveness is there for us. But, you but if you don't confess sin. your sins, that's pride. You keep on sinning. <laughs> and you Naga keep on sinning. Sinning. <laughs> Naga confess kasi sila directly to God. Oh, hindi sa priest. That's, that's oh. Protestantism. and that's my oh, word again. Oh. Oh, oh. Na, only Bible sana, sola scriptura na tawag natin, only Bible. How about uh -huh. Father the Aglipay? We have the same naman, Father, pro the yeah. priest, as wife. Paano yan sila, Father? Well, that's their like different uh, way, way like of life. Uh, practically Maybe. kasi, ang Aglipay, he came as well from one of the bishops that was ordained uh, talagang uh, legally by juridically by by the Catholic Church na nagtiwalag lang so pero nung namatay siya at yung mga na ano niya na ordinahan so wala na rin even yung sacrament of baptism although until such time yung sacrament of baptism nila tanggapan natin kasi nga valid pa yung nag nagbinyag sa kanila lahat now the thing is of course kung ano yung faith nila Hopefully, they follow that one. So, uh, there might be also the seed of salvation for them. Nagkaiba lang kasi siyempre yung pari nila may asawa sa Catholic naman. Wala talaga. So, hindi uh -oh. siya pwede. Kasi may vow of celibacy. Sa kanila kasi walang vow no. of celibacy. But, you know, no. we don't judge other religions. It depends on them how, to, how they are living their faith according to their religion. But, Father, they receive... Communion without confession. I think yeah, that's why that's their uh -huh. own religion. Wala tayo magawa uh -huh. doon. Kasi, di ba, parang basketball lang yan. Eh. If you play basketball, then you follow the rules of the basketball. So, if you, uh -huh. good evening to the next one. If you are Catholic, then you follow the rules of the Catholic. We are guided by the church. We are guided by the canon law natin and so on and so forth. Sa so, naman, they are guided by their own rules. So, malay mo kanila kung yun yun lang, wilang confession. No, pero we do not judge. We do, hindi naman sa Catholic tita, so we do not judge them. That's their own. So, we do not know their own rules. We do not know what they are having. Paano ng doctrine nila? So, conscience na po nila yun. Pero we could not judge them that they should be like us. Na dapat may confession before receiving communion, especially if we have grave sin. So, Iba naman sa atin. Iba naman din sa kanila. Although devoted talaga sila, Father, no? Well, lahat naman. Kahit, ma oh. kahit Muslims are devoted. Iglesia ni Cristo are devoted. Kay Kibuloy naman are devoted. You know, it depends really on what you have accepted. 
and you have your and your faith father and your faith father yeah. diba mm -hmm. uh -huh. so atin we have accepted the catholic faith so sa atin we are taught that there is confession kasi from confession the priest is the representative of the lord to give forgiveness so when you go out of the confessional you are sure that you are forgiven by the lord unless lang the priest would say oh i will not give you absolution kasi you are not doing <laughs> you are not also doing your penance you are not doing things <laughs> kasi may ibang pare na they would not give absolution oh okay so what happened na there Oh, 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 um, solution. Dalawang bagay yan kasi yung isa kung mga kasalanan na holy see o bishop lang mag, ano, magpatawa, then you go to the bishop. For example, before oh, abortion, the, we priests without the delegation of the bishop could not give absolution. So, oh, but with Pope okay. Francis, we are given as such. Now, minsan, nakikita ng pare ang judgment niya na, you know, ah, ito naman, palagi wala din, he see or he does not change life lalo pagkakilala ka, so he would challenge you. I will not give a solution unless, ganon. Example, mga ganun mga live in so I will not oh, give a okay. solution until you go into marriage. Kasi you will mm -hmm. just continue living in sinfulness as well. You just pray on your own father for economy mo father ang mga ganun ng absolution sa sarili mo. Pwede ba yan? In the absolution comes from the priest. Yeah, the absolution comes from the priest. But if you are sorry for your sins, then you change your life really. So then you go back to ask for forgiveness. Because my transformation. So there is a transforming life. So yun ang ginagawa. May questions na pala kaya. Father, sabi nga ni ni Tito Mani, magsabi lang kami nga. OMG, binial say na father. Pag ang, of course, if you make if you make an expression na wala na mga katuturan, na just for the sake na expression, it could be. Pero when you say, oh my God, na with all sincerity, kasi nagulat lang, oh my God. Ginawa na expression, oo. Oh, Kahit naman, para naki, nakita mo yung pangit. Oh my God, ang pangit niya. Is what magamitin pa si Lord? Oh my God. So, Mother, so you, you, you Mother. use oh my God with malice. <laughs> Ginamit mo pa si Mother, Lord. Yes, I have tayo. a question. Yes, tayo. Mother, I have a question. Um, yes, po. po. Father, um, po. In, there's the part in our Holy Mass that... Mm -hmm. uh, we have, uh, I confess to all my brothers and sisters. When we yes, do Father. that, and when we prayed for that prayer, I confess to mm. all my brothers and sisters and to you, uh, my God, something like that. That mm. does mean that we are already excused for not coming to the confessional box and confess our the sins we've committed. Since we were already uh, at that at that time when we prayed, uh, the part I I've confessed to all my brothers and sisters, we were already blessed by the priest. Yeah, two things lang po tita rin. Dalawang bagay yan. Pag ang grave sin, it's not forgiven, so you have really to confess it. Now, convenial sins. During the mass, that's forgiven when you do the confiture. I confess you, Almighty God, to you, my brothers and sisters, and the absolution of the priest. Pero for perfection, it's still nice to confess those venial sins when you go to confession. So uh, I repeat, ang mortal sins are never forgiven during that part, that time. It's only for the venial sins. That's why you have to go if there are mortal sins, you have to confess. But for the sake of perfection, even the venial sins have been forgiven, it's still nice to confess it, okay. confess them. Oh, thank you, Father. Uh -huh. mga, um, um, do we have to repeat the, the same uh, sin asking for forgiveness? Kung forgiven na tayo, Father. For example, uh, the, the, the following month, you, you confess again. Pero e yung mga forgiven sins... I mean, for example, you confess. You confess last month. For example, you told a lie. 
So after that confession, you you committed again okay. again the, the lie. Then you have to confess. So those are kasi actual sins that you have committed after the last confession. So they uh-huh. should be confessed. Uh-huh. Pero once absolved, okay na ang mga sins. No? Oh, once basta na, you just repeat ano, it. Na, uh-huh. 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 Oh, basta you, you, you don't repeat it. The, the, uh-huh. sin, the same uh-huh. sin. If it is not repeated, then you are already absolved uh-huh. from it. Cleansed ka na. Uh-huh. How about Father? They said that if we enter the church, we wait cross tayo, Father. Holy hmm. water. Diba? Hmm. They said that it's already forgiven, Father, because holy water and the holy and the I know the cross. Diba? It is forgiven or sin? No, no. You are just being cleansed. You you ask the Lord to cleanse you with that holy water. But again, confession is still necessary. So you are cleansed from whatever, hopefully, from the bad thoughts, from the malice, and the holy water covers you. Hopefully, if you are serious really with it, that when you make a sign of cross with the holy water on your on yourself, I say the prayer that is Lord cleansed me from my impurities. So that is the prayer when you have the holy water. So it's a cleansing one. So, but what is the best cleansing is you go to confession. To confession. Uh, that is a preparatory thing for you to be cleansed. Oh, very Thank nice. you, Father. <laughs> welcome, welcome. So again, Father. do not use the name of God when there is <laughs> negativity Father. or malice about. Yes, what it means. Does this narrow door still exist? In Jerusalem, po, In Jerusalem. yes. Po. That's the door for the camels. Kasi, di ba, uh, what they were doing is that during the Feast of Tabernacles, the Feast of Light, they bring all those things that they are selling uh, uh, near the courtyard of the Jerusalem Temple. So, may way lang talaga when you are bringing your camel, the camel's passage is through that narrow door lang po. That's why the reference of Jesus before, it, this is here for the camel to enter the needle's eye than for the rich man to enter the kingdom of heaven. So the narrow door of St. Luke is saying could be also a reference to that narrow door being used by the camels. Mm. Pero in the spiritual sense, the narrow door, it's a narrow door really of forgiveness which is too hard, of love, which is too hard, of dying for one, for others, which is too hard. These are the harder things that what Jesus, Jesus has done. done. So, but then the wider doors, malice, chismes, negativity, but, hopelessness, ito yung mga malalaking wider. doors na, yeah, easy, wider uh-huh. doors na the people can just easily do without thinking what would be the consequence. Uh-huh. So, so that means ang narrow doors pala is uh, uh, sufferings. Um, be suffering, no? yes. Suffering, so. Pain. Dala na yan, oo. Pain, so. Pain. Mm-hmm. Yeah, what mm-hmm. the Lord had done, that's the narrow door. Uh-huh. So it's not easy. It's not yes. easy, pero. Kung uh-huh. mga Taba ka, hindi ka. <laughs> <laughs> hindi tayo kasi ya, Grace. Masira daw yung door, Tita. Masisira. Nagkilid lang. Pagtakilid ka lang, Tita. Takilid. Gilid konti. O sige pa, sige pa. Gamay pa, gamay. Tita Flor, what if you nak... Big time, may katita floor. Hindi ka pa rin yung kasya. Pangstahamak mo, magtagilid. Magtagilid lang. Magtagilid ka, Sister Grace. Ibis nga, nagaharap ka kay Lord. Nagtagilid ka. Nagtagilid ka. Ano, Tito Mads? Labas mo, kaya ito. <laughs> Ay, ko. Hindi ka nag-iisa, Tita Grace. 
<laughs> oh, it's, that's the nice of it. <laughs> Very good. So let's enter the narrow door. So magpapayat. Mag-lose weight muna. Mag-lose weight. Mag-diet. So, uh, so that's a challenge of the Lord today. Let us enter the narrow door in the spiritual yes. sense. Uh, uh, amen. So, dreaming of everything, amen. dreaming of our eyes, dreaming of our hearts, of our ears, all for the kingdom of God. Amen. So, have a nice evening. See you tomorrow. Thank you very much, you Father. Tomorrow. We love you more, Father. Bye. Bye, Bye. Bye. Bye Father. God bless. Father. Please go ahead. The three pointers for today's gospel. Number one, the kingdom of God does not belong solely to a restricted group of people who profess that they believe in Jesus as their Savior. The quality of our belief depends on how Christ-like our daily living is. Number two, in today's gospel, Jesus is asserting that we should not take our faith for granted. Mm -hmm. Instead, we are all challenged to nurture our faith, hope, and love for our Lord in our daily living. Number three, Jesus is also challenging us not to be self-righteous and judgmental. Let God be the judge. Just focus ourselves on becoming more authentic disciples of the Lord. Amen. 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 Oh, thank you very much, Tita Lynn. Oh. Any nuggets, Tito Mans? Sabi na ata ni Padre. Lahat. Oh. Narrow door. Oh. Narrow door. Siguro oh. ma, pag nag-pilgrimage kayo, madaanan nyo ito siguro. Narrow door. Dadaan kayo sa marami o oh, marami kaming ma... Yeah, it's true. No? So. So, anyway... Naro, no? Pero ang camel, malaki. Di ba malaki ang camel? Malaki ang camel? Oh, I haven't seen a camel. I have seen a camel. It's big. It's big. So, <laughs> so ginawang naro pala para hindi sila makapasok. Sila makadaan. Oh. Maka, Di ba hindi may maka... hunchback yun? May hunchback? Mm -hmm. Oo. Oh, oh, oh. Ibig sabihin oh, doon is you cannot enter na meron kam dalang bagahe doon. Yeah, it's true. Mm -hmm. Oo, oh, kung bagahe mo mga it mga is. ano mo, oh, mm -hmm. mga sinfulness mo and mm -hmm. ang mga kwan mo hindi ka pwede makadaan. Oh. So, yun uh, that that is the symbol pala, symbol of ano. Uh, the narrow door is the difficulty to enter the kingdom of God because you really have to suffer. Lahat naman tayo is nagka-suffer pero it's a, it, it depends on ano ba na for uh, ano acceptance mo nga si Jesus Christ nga nag-suffer anak siya ng anak siya ng Dios eh nag-suffer tayo kaya and and ang, ang ano ba ang ang acceptance natin and uh, and um, you know um to glorify him and it's a one kind of ano one one type of uh, purification natin ang mga sufferings na yan um, lahat naman tayo mag-suffer in, in any form, no whatever form or type or shape, whatever intensity, talaga mag-suffer tayo. Uh, it's, it's part of our life naman kasi. Uh, so, ang narrow door na yan is uh, sufferings, pains. Uh, pero ang, 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 ano, ang, kung dyan is ang after passing through the narrow door. Yun, ang ano Yun. natin. Mm -mm. After passing through the narrow door. Yun. Tapos, uh, uh, ang, ang door ng, sa kabila naman is uh, so easy, so wide and so easy. 
Kaya maraming maraming tao na na uh, a lot of people have have wrong choices ba na na instead of of going through the narrow door no, doon sila sa wider and uh, ano wider and comfortable doors. Pero diyan ang mga kasalanan. Mga mga ano mga mga judgmental, mga pride, mga lahat na. Kaya nga sabi nila, eh, the road to hell is paved with good intentions. See? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Kaya... It's so deceiving. Yun. It's so deceiving. This in uh, good intentions. Uh -oh. Kaya nga sinabi dito, we ate and drank in your company mm -hmm. and toted our streets. Uh -oh. But all these things must be coupled with uh, not only good intentions, but with action. No? We must act on it. Anong nababasa natin sa gospel? Sa... We must act. There must be an action. Not just uh, reading the Bible. Uh, or declaring yourself, I'm a Catholic, I do this, I do yeah, that. Yeah. That's what Father Danny said. There must be an action through this uh, through this uh, poor people. Uh, love of neighbor is uh, uh, yeah it's true tapos what how do you feel kaya yung nag nagmeet na kayo ni Jesus uh, i uh, in front of we one on one na kayo tapos sabihin sabihin ka ni Jesus na do i know you yeah Oh the, no, do I know you? Yan ang nakakatakot. That's yan ang nakakatakot sa lahat. Oo. Tapos sabihin mo pa na, ah, magkasama tayo noon sa simbahan. Ah, magkasama tayo noon sa ganito. No. Don't presume. Yan ay sabi ng, ng ano, isa daily gospel, daily gospel and reflections na isang ano. Yun, presumption. Gina-presume mo. Oo na. Anyway, nagasimba ka, nagaganito ka, nagadeclare ka Catholic ka. And yet, after that, after going to mass or hearing mass, siguro or joining the mass, ah, may mga may mga bad habits ka pa. Before my life, oh, kaya it's it's really a challenge. It's really a challenge to pass through that that narrow door. Pag mag-decide pa lang, mag-decide pa lang which, which door you're going to, get, to go through, decision pa lang is mahirap na kasi very very deceiving nga ang, ang wider door. Easy yeah, and when, wider. When someone asked him, will only a few people be saved? Yeah. He, huh, huh. he just huh. said, strive to enter the narrow door. Wala siyang figures na sinabi. No, uh -oh. Kunti o marami. Uh -oh, wala. So it's it's still our choice, no? We're still given the free the, the free will, no? And and uh, uh -oh. so it depends on us. Yeah, it's true to ito money. No, he didn't uh, he didn't uh, say figures, no? He didn't yeah, answer. Mm -hmm. So it depends on us talaga. It depends on us. Kasi, yeah. kasi nga is my free will tayo. So depende sa atin kung anong decision natin. Which yes. door to enter? Huh? So, so ang 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 ano natin no? ang examination of conscience natin no? Are are we do? Uh, are are we living our life as expected us to be uh, like a good Christian? Are we are we living that kind of life? So, yun lang. Either, either for for the poor to to help the poor, or to, uh, uh, to help our bro uh, brothers and sisters, no, or to live in a material world, worldly, you know, worldly, worldly uh, surroundings, mga pleasures, mga promise of pleasures, na ano na gina offer that the the wider and easier door is offering 
versus mga ano mga sufferings na sa ano sa sa, sa narrow door. So it's our choice. Si Jesus nga hindi nagsabi ng figures, marami kayo or kunti lang, wala. Binigyan tayo na example kaya we have to pick our choice. Kasi masakit siguro and siguro I don't know kung anong anong ma-feel mo na magsabi si Jesus na do I know you? Kilala ba kita? I know. Oo, do I know you? Lord, hindi mo ba ako natamdaan? Pakita mo yung passport Makita mo passport mo. Oo. Tapos tapos ang, ang passport mo hindi matanggap kasi ang passport mo is mga diploma, mga bank account, mga, pra, mga, mga land titles, mga ganyan. <laughs> sabihin ka, sabihin ka, sabihan ka ni San Pedro, hindi yan kasali, wala yan. <laughs> Bali, wala yan. <laughs> like, tapos tanungin ka, o oh, sige, saan ang puso mo? Yan. Ipakita mo nga ang puso mo. Hmm. Ang tanong so, lang ni San Pedro doon is for I was hungry. See, yun ang mga uh, tanong doon. Uh, 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 it's true. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Did you was help she, me? Uh, yeah, you know. Yun, uh, napapasok yung love of neighbor. Yan. Uh, 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 it's true. Uh, uh, I need food. I was hungry and thirsty. Did you give me? Did you help me? You know, oh, yun, sure. yun lang. Oh. As simple as that, no? It's true to it to money, no? Isang, isang yeah. tanong lang ni San, Pedro, ni San Pedro siguro, no? Did you feed me? <laughs> yeah. Did you close me? Oh. Did you provide shelter? Did you help me? Yun lang. Kasi, oo. Oo, kasi it, it reflects sa uh, love of neighbor. Eh. Tapos, it's, so, it's, it's impossible to love God without loving the neighbor. Yun lang. Universal. Very, very universal. Ang very universal. Um, anyway, um, that ends our prayer meeting for today. Huh? Okay. Um, may we hear the closing prayer, please? Okay, Gabilen. Please, please unmute. Okay. Okay. Uh, Almighty and everlasting God, as we bring this prayer meeting to a close, we pray that we continue to be united in our common purpose and the next step as, you, as needed to take. Give us guidance and bring us tranquility to our hearts. Amen. 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 And Amen. glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the, and and to the, the Holy Spirit, Spirit. Spirit. As, as it was in the beginning, in the beginning now and ever shall be, now and ever shall be, without, without end. end. Amen. 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 In the name of the, name of the Father, the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you very much. Bye. 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 Bye.